talk about this is uh, section 2.4 um, and this is on uh, division with fractions okay uh, divisions uh, with uh, fractions um, have you guys uh, heard the word reciprocal before? Reciprocal before, the word, <coughs> the word reciprocal. Uh, it's called reciprocal. The word reciprocal means that if I have two numbers, two numbers are called the reciprocal of each other if their product is zero. Sorry, is the, if their product is one. So what's the reciprocal of two? The reciprocal of two is one half. Because the product of two and a half is one. So anytime two numbers, you have two numbers whose product is one, they are called the reciprocal of each other. The reciprocal of two is half. What's, what would be the reciprocal of one quarter? The reciprocal of one quarter would be four, right? Because if you multiply four and one quarter, you get one. What would be the reciprocal of three four? Three fourth. You want another fraction so that the okay. no the reciprocal of three fourth. Okay, let me first uh, write down the uh, write down what I just said. That two numbers, uh, two numbers uh, whose product is one, whose uh, product is one, um, are uh, said to be reciprocals. Are said to be uh, reciprocals. So for example, um, if you think about two multiplied with a half, I get one. So half is the reciprocal of two, or I can say two is the recipro reciprocal of half. Uh, another example, if I have one quarter, what number should I multiply that with to get one? Well, four. So the reciprocal of one quarter is uh, four. Okay, so other examples. If I have the number three-fourth, right? What number should I multiply that with to get one? Three, three, three. Uh, no, no. Four. One. Four-third, yeah. right? So if I ju just take the four-third, I mean, all I do is exchange the numerator and the denominator, right? And then the product is one, right? Uh, last time I showed you how to <coughs> multiply fractions, right? You multiply the <coughs> numerator, you multiply the denominators. When you multiply the numerators here, you get 12. Denominator you get 12, so 12 over 12 is 1. Or you can just cancel out. You can see when you multiply, remember, you're, you, you're allowed to cancel out the common factors, right? Okay. Uh, so that's what we mean the, by uh, the uh, reciprocals, okay? Now, we, are we use a notation here. Uh, one notation that we are going to use to express... Uh, reciprocal is that um, if A is a non-zero number, uh, then it's reciprocal 
is denoted by 1 over a. Okay? Uh, well, the reciprocal of 2 is half. So a is 2, then its reciprocal is half. Uh, but uh, if I write the following uh, notation, say 1 divided by a half, what do we mean here? 1 divided by a half, it means the reciprocal of half. And the reciprocal of half is what? What's the reciprocal of half? Uh, one. Two, right? Two. Uh, remember, reciprocal means I'm looking for a number so that the product is one, right? So the reciprocal of half is one. So when I'm writing one divided by half, it means, it means the reciprocal of half. Reciprocal of half. And we know that the reciprocal of half is what? Two. You, that's a number so that the product with half gives you one. Everybody is clear on that? Questions? Can you please read the notation? Yeah, notation. Okay. If A is a non-zero number, if A is a non-zero number, then its reciprocal is half, is 1 over a. If a is any non-zero number, then its reciprocal is the fraction 1 over a. Is that making sense? How do you find the reciprocal of any number? You just divide it by, you just divide 1 by that number. Is that? So what's the reciprocal of 2? Well, you divide 1 by 2, you get half. The reciprocal of 2... Reciprocal means two numbers are reciprocal if their product is 1. Two numbers, they are called reciprocal of each other if their product is 1. So think about 2 and a half, 4 and a 1 quarter, okay? Think about those numbers. Well, if you have 3 fourth, what's the reciprocal of that? It's 4 third. So reciprocal basically means you switch the numerator and the denominators, okay? okay. All you need is their product to be 1. Is that making sense? Okay. So that's uh, there. Um, let's see. Now, if I have, if I, oops. Okay, if I have, Give me one second, like my uh, pen is not working for some reason.
Okay, we are still in section 2.4. Um, okay, so rem uh, remember, say if I have, if I have the uh, fraction three, three divided by four, then if I multiply that by four divided by three, I get one. So these are the reciprocals of each other. So we can express, okay, we, we write, we sometimes express this by <laughs> saying that uh, four third is equal to one divided by three quarter, okay? So I am dividing one, this is new because before we had one divided by a whole number, right? Yeah. In the denominator we always had only whole numbers, now I have fractions. So what's the meaning of that? If I'm writing one divided by a fraction, I mean the reciprocal of that fraction. Right? The reciprocal of the fraction 3 fourth is 4 third. So when I write 1 whole divided by 3 quarter, I mean the number 4 over 3. Everybody is clear on that? So 1 divided by a fraction means, 1 divided by a fraction means the reciprocal of that fraction. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Any, qu any questions on this? Now, we can, now we want to talk about how you, how do you divide fractions, okay? So if I, if I, how do I divide one fraction by another fraction? Okay, so uh, here's, here's how we do it. Suppose I have a fraction A over B, and I want to divide that by another fraction C over D. Okay, well, Dividing by a number is the same. So suppose I want to divide something by a 2, right? Suppose I have a number, I want to divide that number by 2. Isn't that the same as multiplying that number by half? If I want to divide a number by 2, it's the same as multiplying that number by half. So in this case, I want to divide this fraction by this fraction. And I can write it as A over B, and then multiply by the reciprocal of the second fraction. So when I, when I have this division here, what's the numerator and what's the denominator? C, C over D is the denominator. So I take the reciprocal of that. I take the reciprocal of that. So this is 1 over C divided by D. So that's the reciprocal of C over D, but the reciprocal of C over D is just D over C. So A over B times D over C. Okay? So that means if, I, if I'm dividing a fraction by another fraction, all I have to do is the fraction in the denominator, I just flip it and multiply. Okay? So let's uh, look at some examples. So examples. Okay, so let's say I am dividing half by by one quarter, okay? What is that equal to? Half multiplied with four divided by one, as you said, and this is equal to what? Four over two is equal to what? Two. Two. Or we can you can just cancel out the the same factor, right? So four has